the rain. <laughs> oh, goody! A puddle! <laughs> I can see you like splashing around in your wellies. Uh-huh. And I like how the grass smells really green. I suppose it does. like a rainbow, Princess. A rainbow? Yes. You sometimes see them in the sky when the sun comes out after the rain. Oh, it's like the rain left a present. <laughs> Has anything new happened recently? On with this. I scratched my knee. Oh, dear. <laughs> Princess? <gasps> Come back, Princess! Slow down! Feeling peckish, Princess! Oh, lovely day for it! Hello again, Princess! Oh. We didn't realise, Poppet. <laughs> no, we didn't. And this is certainly a surprise. Thank you, Pr... Um... Why is your table pink, dear? Because it's just like the night I asked you to marry me. No, everything was yellow that night. No, everything was pink. It was yellow. No, I'm sure it was pink. No, no, it was definitely yellow. No, it was pink. It was pink because I remember you had a pink <laughs> boy. <laughs> <laughs> And one eye dolly, squeaky bird. My goodness, Princess, what a huge pile. I'm building a tower in order of toys I like best. And your favourite? Uh, Gilbert. Aha. Uh -huh. <laughs> oh, no! <laughs> Good morning, Princess. Uh, you appear to have something in your hair. Oh. Bendy pasta. Mustn't have come off in the bath last night. My picture! What is it? What now, Princess? What's happened? There's bits on it that weren't there yesterday. <gasps> <gasps> Who would do such a thing? Maybe they were trying to help, Poppet. I don't need help. Such a shame. It looks so... so... So much... better. J 
just what I was going to say. One potato. Two potato. Three potato. Who do you think it was? All very strange. Whatever will she add next? I do know lots of interesting things I can tell. I am going to tell you lots of interesting things. Wow! Ooh. How exciting! <laughs> Did you know that rabbits only eat vegetables? They especially like carrots. Yes, Gardner? Uh, oh, yes, yes, they're herbivores. Oh, animals that only eat plants are called herbivores. Ah, I did not know. And that's why they have such lovely white teeth. <laughs> oh, did you know that spaghetti is my favourite food and it comes from a place called Italy? Uh, Princess? Yes, Chef? And so does your second favourite food. Pizza! Italy is a culinary delight of a country, huh? Lovely place. Oh, I love a pizza. Oh. Uh. Did you know that the moon is a very long way away? And when you think it's not in the sky, it is. It's just hiding. Mm -hmm. Actually, it's 238,855 miles away, and whether you can see it or not depends on the angle of the sun, moon and earth. Really? Uh, I didn't know that. <laughs> but I'm the teacher! Did you know that it is impossible to pat your head and rub your tummy at the same time? I know. I've tried. Oh. It is possible, Princess. It, it just takes a bit of practice. Look! Oh, what happened? Uh, what was that? <laughs> Hello, Princess. Looking for something? Yes, I'm looking for things to make me old. Oh, and why is that? Because everyone gets to stay up and see Great Auntie tonight except me. Oh dear, that doesn't seem fair. It's not, and it's because I'm too young. If I'm old, I'll be able to stay up late. So you're looking for... These! Oh, they're very... Uh... Grown up. I know. Hmm. And is that all you need? Um, just a few more things. The princess, where are you off to now? To see if it's worked. And how will you do that? I'm going to see the oldest person I know to ask if he thinks I'm old enough to stay up late. Are you lost? Admiral! It's me! <gasps> Shiver me timbers! It's the princess! You look very grown up. Good, eh? Grown up enough to stay up late? Hmm. I'd say grown up enough to stay up until at least eight bells. <laughs> Gilbert made of metal. He's a robot, not a kettle. Having a good time with Gilbot, Princess? Smooth and shiny like a tea. Princess? Hmm? Are you having a... Zip it, zip it. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, Princess. You, uh, appear to have a spoon on your nose. Uh-huh. I know how to make it stay there without falling off. Really? You have to breathe on it first. <sighs> well, that's very clever. How do you know how to do that? I know lots of things. <laughs> Follow me. I know how 
able to make music with this piece of grass. <laughs> that is marvellous, Princess. It's easy. You just have to hold it like this and blow. <laughs> I know other things too. <laughs> Come on. <gasps> To make this balloon stick to the wall. You just have to do this. <laughs> well done, Princess. You're a very good teacher. Eh? What's a teacher? A teacher is someone who knows lots of interesting things. Oh. And they show people how to do them. <gasps> I can show people how to do things. Maybe I could be a teacher. I, uh, well, I, I suppose you could... Oh. <gasps> What's happened to my tree? Um... Oh, dear. Well... I'm afraid, Puppet, that the wind was very strong last night and it blew over your tree. Yes, dear. Look, you can see its roots sticking out. It, it can't live without its roots in the ground, Princess. Well, put them back in. Ah, sorry, Princess. It's, it's a very old tree and too big to replant. I, we'll have to chop it down. What? You can't chop it down. It's just a bit wonky. It's dangerous, Puppet. It could fall over. But it's my treasure tree. I'm sorry, sweetheart, but we have to. You need to stay safe. You're not to go near it now. They're not going to chop down my tree. <laughs> hey ho, princess. Are you all right? No. Everyone wants to chop down my tree. <gasps> but that's terrible. I love your tree. Nessie and I often shelter under it when it rains. Do you really? Oh, well, come with me, please. Oh, I say. OK, this way, Nessie. Do you like my tree? Which tree is that? The one I dangle from that gives me treasure. Oh, well, yes, I suppose so. Good. Come with me, please. Do you like my tree, Chef? Hmm? Mm, uh, trees are OK, but uh, I prefer cupcakes. Uh, et voilà. Good. This way, please. Huh? We don't want you to chop down my tree, do we? Um, no, I'm not sure. Huh? What tree? But pop it, it's not safe. It could fall on someone and hurt them. <gasps> fall on someone? Quick, chop it down. Chop it down. What? Sorry, princess. They're right. If it's too dangerous. Mm-hmm. The tree needs the chop. My tree is not being chopped down. Hello, Princess. Whatever's the matter? We've got a new toilet. Oh, that's nice. No, it's not. It's too big and I'm too small. What if I fall down it? Oh. Well, perhaps you ought to tell someone that you're worried. I feel silly. And everyone else likes it so much. Especially Great Ante. I see. Well, what are you going to do? I'm going to have to find a different toilet to use. At least until I'm bigger. <laughs> Where are you off to then, Princess? 
the shed. Great Auntie said she used a toilet in a shed when she was little. Uh, oh, are you sure it was this shed that she used? Yes, and there's the bucket. Oh. There's a froggy thing living in it. I don't think he'd like it if I turned his house into a toilet. No, I don't think he would. What will you do now? I'll have to think of something else. Pandora? Knock, knock. There is someone at the door. No, I say knock, knock, then you say who's there. Who's there? Knock, knock. <sighs> Hello, Princess. What are you doing? I'm talking to Pandora, but she doesn't understand knock, knock jokes. That's a shame. Maybe you could ask her to do something. Oh. Uh, Pandora, can you play Princess Says? I don't know. Princess Says. Is it a song? No, it's... Perhaps a... you might like another song. No, Pandora! I said... Did you say bed? Good night. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't Pandora the best? And she has such a lovely voice. I've got a lovely voice too. La 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 la. Of course you have, sweetheart. Maybe Pandora could sing for Great Auntie when Chef brings in her profiteroles. Oh, Great Auntie would love that. <laughs> you finish up your banana custard, Poppet. And we'll go and tell Chef. Wait there, Pandora. We'll be right back. Flubber lubber dub. <laughs> Pardon, Pandora. Flutty flutty flim flum plop 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 plop. Talk properly, Pandora. Rinko plinko blah 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 blah. Uh, oh no, I think I've broken Pandora. <laughs> Blue I've got to find a hiding place. Oh. Castle Day! Princess, <laughs> uh, you've got blue paint on your. Never mind. Castle Day! Castle Day! Castle. My picture! Poppet, I say, what has happened? <laughs> My picture. Someone finished it with shiny sparkles. I wanted to do it myself. Well, there, there, Poppet. <gasps> <gasps> What's this? Bendy pasta? And is that my loo roll? And paint on my hands. But I had a bath last night. You did. I made sure of it. <laughs> I wonder if we may have caught you a uh, blue-handed puppet. When I was a boy, I used to sleepwalk. You went for a walk while you were asleep? Exactly. Uh, one year before Castle Day, I baked a Wellington boot pie in my sleep. <laughs> <laughs> Sleepwalking runs in our family, Poppet. Oh. Really? Oh. So I think it may have been you who finished your picture. Me? While I was asleep? That would explain the paint on your hands. And my bendy pasta on your back. And the nice shiny sparkles on your nighty. Oh! <laughs> 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 I wish it was Castle Day every day. <laughs> Attention! Attention, everybody! I have a big present for the castle. Oh, I shall. Oh, what oh. can it be? But first, Puss and Scruff have something very special to show you. <laughs> Bravo! Uh, they tried. <laughs> they don't 
won't give up the day job. And now, my picture! Oh, at last! Your date's finished. Ta-da! Oh. <laughs> Oh, look! There's me. And me! Everyone! The castle! They're magnificent. It's marvellous! Do you like it, Daddy? It's the best present this castle has ever had. Oh. And don't worry about the sleepwalking Poppet. You'll grow out of it. Oh. Poppet? I don't want to grow out of it. I did my best work ever when I was asleep. <laughs> well, it's certainly better than I could do. Happy Castle Day! In the story, the prince plants the beans in the ground. So let's dig! And in go the beans. There! Now I've got to give the ground a pat. I've seen Gardner do that. Oh, I know. Water. Plants need water to grow. Daddy said so. Have a nice drink, Beans. <laughs> Any time now. <laughs> Maybe if I sing a growing song. Grow, grow, beanie beans, up into the sky. Hurry up, beanie beans, or you'll make me cry. Hello, Princess. How are you getting on? Not very well. Oh, dear. Maybe you ought to ask Gardner for some help. Mm. The prince in the story didn't need to ask anyone for help. But OK. Mm. So this is where you planted your beans, eh? Yes, baked beans from Chef. I planted them and patted them and watered them and sung them a song. But they didn't grow into a beanstalk. <laughs> Princess, baked beans are more for eating than growing. Oh, uh, uh, no. Uh, no. How are you getting on, Princess? Not good. No. No! No! It stopped! Naughty door! What now, Princess? Ah! Oh. Oh, the surprise! Scruff, you stand guard outside. It's just a plasticky thing. Oh, I wonder what this does. Oh, oh, get in! Get back in! Oh, oh stop! Please, stop growing! Princess, do you think it might have been wise to leave it? Uh, yes, I do now. Oh, ah, no! What's going on in there? It sounds like someone's got the most awful... Hello? It's me. Princess! <laughs> I opened Daddy's big box and the plasticky thingy inside came to life. I think this is a job for the army. Oh. Go ahead, General. Stand back, everyone. Right. <laughs> Here we go. Oh, don't worry, Puppet. We'll get you out. We're coming, dear. Deep breaths, everyone. Deep breaths. Oh, oh. oh. down, plasticky thingy. Down. I'm not sure that's going to work, Princess. <laughs> it won't listen. Puss and I are going to be stuck in here forever. <laughs> 
I'll summon my regiment for help. I'm all good, boss. It's just very close. Oh, Ouch! Boss, your claws. Boss, <gasps> maybe you could use one of your claws to make a hole in the plasticky thing. Ouch! Splendid. Princess. The Bouncy Castle nearly took over the whole place. Bouncy Castle? Bouncy Castle! I've always wanted one of those. Me too. Sorry. I should have waited. I've ruined the surprise for everyone now. That's OK, Poppet. I only wanted you to wait so we could all enjoy it together. I think you just love surprises a little too much. Trouble is, I love surprises too. Especially giving them. Oh, you big soft. That's nice. Well, let's get back to work. <laughs> Good job, men. <laughs> Wait. I am more happy than corn that is popping. I can't think what it might be. And why we had to take off our shoes. <laughs> Daddy? That's <laughs> marvellous. Let the fun begin. <gasps> Surprise! <gasps> Daddy, help me fix it. <laughs> Hooray! <laughs> oh, this is a surprise and well worth the wait. Which makes it the best surprise ever. A robot too, Scruff. You're a scruff bot. What can a scruff bot do? <laughs> Very clever. But can a scruff bot talk? Yummy baked beans, please. <laughs> what about this? Gilbot, please fetch me a flower. Gilbot is the best at being a robot. <laughs> my head! It seems to have gone from my head. <laughs> Someone sneak the shoe! Having the strangest dream. One of your claws, puss. <laughs> it's 
not going to work. Oh. Maybe there's another key somewhere. Castle day, my furry friends. Lots to do before we celebrate. <laughs> hat, like Mummy. Oh. Very nice. Have you got everything you need now? There's just one more thing. Sure, Poppy. You look through this bit here. Can I have a go yet? And then when you're happy, you press this button here. And then you can look at your picture. Is it my 
turn now. What are you going to take a picture of, Poppy? <laughs> Gilbert. Ow. That's not bad for a first try. Where are you off to, Poppet? I'm for sorry, like you and Mummy. Oh. What can you see, Princess? Grass and some bushes. <coughs> Excuse me, Puss. I'm looking for interesting animals doing interesting things. Hmm. Oh. Bunnies, can you do something interesting for my picture, please? Hmm. <laughs> it's not very interesting. Come back here! Says we think uh, we might have been a bit unfair too. <laughs> so we spent our naughty step time designing the new seesaw. <laughs> oh, it's lovely. I think it's time to build a seesaw. <laughs> You look like you're in a hurry. I am. There's going to be a picture show. Oh? It's all about animals. Not normal, boring animals like Puss and Scruff. But interesting animals like lions and heavens. in the ground. So let's dig. And in go the beans. There. Now I've got to give the ground a pat. I've seen Gardner do that. Oh, I know. Water. Plants need water to grow. Daddy said so. 
Have a nice drink, Beans. <laughs> Any time now. <laughs> Maybe if I sing a growing song. Grow, grow, beany beans, up into the sky. Hurry up, beany beans, or you'll make me cry. Hello, Princess. How are you getting on? Not very well. Oh, dear. Maybe you ought to ask Gardener for some help. Mm. The prince in the story didn't need to ask anyone for help. But OK. Blanket Princess? Yay! Well done, sweetheart. It looks like my Whopper plant grower is a success. Hmm. I still prefer to grow things naturally in my allotment. <laughs> <laughs> Where are you off to, eh? <laughs> you should be nesting. It's a goose. <laughs> Actually, it's my new chicken, Griselda. Mmm. She does love to play with other animals. <laughs> oh, oh. How sweet. Be nice, Puss. Oh. <laughs> Our first egg. Oh, good work, Griselda. A golden egg. Especially for you, Princess. Uh, <laughs> thank you. Phew. What a hot day. There's Puss and Scruff. It all seems very quiet. Everybody, come to the Great Hall, please. Something exciting is about to happen. Princess, can I have my hat back now, please? Thank you, General. But I don't think I needed it anywhere. <laughs> Thank you too, Scruff. But I don't think I need my owl hat anymore either. I can invent things all on my own. And now, more bubbles! <laughs> Mended the old toilet, sweetheart. This was hiding inside it. Oh, that was why it was making all those gurgly noises and leaking all over the floor. Goodness knows how it got there. I bet I can guess how it got there. 
Princess. Um, this one. <laughs> Queenie! Oh, Queenie! Ooh! Great Auntie, tea will be ready soon. Oh, goody. Uh, can I hear your speech again whilst I wait? Uh, come on, take a seat. Oh, I'm afraid I'm far too busy for that. There's still lots to do. Oh, but you must be tired after all that hard work. Just a tiny sit down, Queenie. Queenie! Got there. <laughs> Is that a time capsule for for pets? Oh. <laughs> well, <laughs> what about doing one of your own? I hear Princess and Algy have done one too, all by themselves. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
<laughs> now, time for a tickle. <laughs> oh, I wanted to stroke you, Puss. <laughs> Hello, Princess. It looks like you and Puss are having fun playing. We are, but he won't let me stroke him. He only wants to do tricks. <laughs> oh. Ah, there you are, Princess. I've been looking for you. Oh, what's that? Ah, this is a very special cat. <laughs> uh, Puss, if you wouldn't mind. <laughs> oh. oh, it looks very sleepy. Mmm. Why don't you try stroking its head? Meow. <laughs> what a lovely fluffy cat! And it does something else. It looks after my Jim Jams. <laughs> <gasps> it's not a real cat. It's a kitty pajama kiss. Hello, Puss. Oh, I don't think he wanted to say hello to us, Nessie. <laughs> Where are you off to, Puss? Oh, bye then. Fancy a tickle, Puss? I'll take that as a no. Pajama kiss. Uh, See? It isn't real. Oh. Oh, please say you'll stay. Hmm. <laughs> <gasps> Yippee! <laughs> I bet you'd like your tea now. <laughs> and you too, Scruff. <laughs> oh, sacre bleu! What has been going on in here? Hello, Princess. Is something wrong? All my swing does is go forwards and backwards. Ah, isn't that what swings are supposed to do? But I always know what's going to happen, like everything else round here. Is that so? Maid is going to come out in a minute and feed Puss and Scruff. Puss! Scruff! <laughs> See? What are you up to, Princess? Wait and see. Maid, will you be my 
my sister? Uh, what do I have to do? First, a special handshake. Like this. Big sis, little sis, la la la. And we've got to share things. Well, I've only got my magazine. That looks boring. <gasps> do you know any secrets? Uh, the Prime Minister hasn't changed his underpants since last Thursday. Oh. Uh, bye! <sighs> That's not gold. Oh, this is a bit like a rainbow. But it's not gold. They're gold coloured, but not shiny. <gasps> Something shiny. But it's silvery, not gold. This isn't what Admiral said I'd find. Hello, Princess. What have you got there? This. <gasps> oh! You found my pendant. It was a present from General. I thought it was lost forever. Oh, thank you so much, Princess. I wish I had a medal. Princess! That's it. Get all that mud off. Ouch! What's wrong, Princess? Oh, you've got a little splinter stuck in there. What's a splinter? A tiny speck of wood. Oh. I was stirring my mud pie with a scratchy stick. Maybe that's how I got it. Not to worry. I can get it out with these tweezers. Um... Princess, lunchtime. Oh, goody. I'm hungry. Bye! Hello, Princess. What are you up to today? Thinking. Oh? About what? What I can do that's really brave. To earn a medal. A medal? Yes. A shiny one. To put right here. Just like Prime Minister. And have you thought of anything brave to do yet? No. Ah. Princess, we don't want that splinter making your hand any worse. Shall we get it out now? Um, uh, 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 I just need to clean Gilbert's face. He's a very messy eater. Hello again, Princess. What Shh. are you... Oh. What are you doing? Hiding. I see. And what are you hiding from? The tweezers. Ah. And have you managed to get a medal yet? No. I've already done two brave things, but no one will give me one. That's a shame. It can't be easy being brave. It's not. Princess! Uh, tweezer time! What I need is a monster to wrestle. Ooh, now that would be brave. Yes. But where might you find a monster? They live in dark, scary places. Hmm, I don't think there are any dark, scary places in the castle. Hmm, there is one. Come on, Gilbert. We're going on a monster hunt. Ready? Ready. Go on. I'm ready. Take it out. But it's already out, Princess. Oh, it's tiny. Princess. Bedtime. You can sleep with me, Gilbert. <laughs> Splash and stick and circly, workily. Princess, bath time. Oh, but I want to keep working on my picture. It'll still be there in the morning. Come on. Oh. And a bit here, and a bit over there, and... You've done a lot, Princess. And my best sock. Princess? And a bit there. <clears throat> You've done a lot. But I haven't finished, and Castle Day is tomorrow. And another bit there. I, uh, bath time now and then bed. 
But I can't stop now. All I've got to do is add these shiny sparkles. You can get up early and do it. Something to look forward to, eh? Uh, forwards. Backwards. Forwards. New toy, Princess. Yes. He's a robot that looks like a teddy. And does your robot teddy have a name? Uh, Gilbot. Gilbot. Bottoms. <laughs> ah! Well, Gilbot certainly has more to say than Gilbert. Uh huh. Go, Gilbot. Go. <laughs> Can we play another game of Princess Says? Oh, I wish I could, Princess. But I've still got to clean the castle. Ah. Oh. Great Auntie is arriving tomorrow, remember? Oh, if only Pandora were here. She'd help in no time. <laughs> Oh. Oh, my. <laughs> Hello, Princess. Are you still? Princess. The picnic is off, Princess. What? But it's our seesaw picnic. I'm afraid I have to clean this mess instead. Thanks to Maid. I was just tying your hair in little bunches so you could see better. It made me forget to put the lid on the blender. And now, we have a pink catastrophe, huh? <laughs> <laughs> At least Gardner will still help. Here you are, Claptrap. Have a banana. Is it nice? Ah. <laughs> banana! Banana! Food! More? Food! Now! But... Ah. Ah. Shh! Someone will tell Great Auntie. Oh, Great Auntie! Oh, Great Auntie! No! I want a lovely souvenir. Ah, ah. Okay, but you're very greedy, Claptrap. Here's a bucket and cloth, Princess. I hear you might need them today. Oh, thank you. Hello, Claptrap. You're very greedy. Oh! Up at his step, chain shuffling. Very good, Princess. You're a bit of a twinkle toes. Hoppy step, chain shuffle it. I do hope the wishy washy of the washing machine isn't disturbing you. Maybe it is. Well, there's a lovely tile floor in the kitchen. I'll bet your tapping would sound marvellous in there. Good idea. Thank you. <sighs> Ready for what, Poppet? Ready for a game of Princess Says. But, sweetheart, we... It's an easy game. I tell you what to do and you do it. Unless I don't say Princess Says first. But, Poppet, we have to practice our dance for Great Auntie's visit tomorrow. Oh. Can't we play my game for a little bit? Shall we? Oh, let's. Come and play. Why well, can't, Princess? The castle must be cleaned before Great Auntie gets here. Just a teeny weeny game. Oh, I suppose so. Princess says, touch your toes with your nose. <laughs> <laughs> Princess says, be a hungry octopus. Hungry octopus? Oh, I can do that, yeah. <laughs> Very good. Is it my turn yet? No. Put your fingers in your ears 
Shut your eyes and do bunny hops. <laughs> 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 You're all out. <laughs> I didn't say princess says first. <laughs> you look very busy, princess. I am. And there's still lots to do. What are you making? You'll see. <gasps> Stickers. One, two, three. The General, Prime Minister and I decided to help. We rather like the sound of a doll's house. I raked the leaves. Nessie and I cleaned the King's car. And I did the washing up. Oh, thank you. I'm... Uh... Gilbert is very pleased. Aren't you, Gilbert? Maybe now Daddy will get him. A, a doll's, doll's house? house? It looks like Gilbert already has one, Princess. But... It's only until he gets a proper one. Oh, but it's so much better than any doll's house I've ever seen. I've never seen finer. Quite the most unique. It is? Yes. Of course. Oh, no, absolutely. Because you're making it yourself. I am. Gilbert will be very pleased. Maybe you could all help me finish it and then we can play. If Gilbert doesn't mind sharing. He says it's OK. Right, let's make a start then. Oh, yes! Be delighted. I'll make a tiny stable for a tiny Nessie. Ooh, good idea. Just the thing. <laughs> and I'll build a tiny track for a tiny tricycle. <laughs> and once the dining room is finished, I'll put my tiny tea set in it. Oh, good air. <laughs> Hello, Princess. Come to give me a hand with this dusty rug. Uh-huh. But I can show you a much better way to get the dust out. Can you now? You've got to hit it really hard. <laughs> I think it's best to shake a dusty rug gently, Princess. <laughs> Oops. Uncover your eyes now, Algie. Good day, Algie. Welcome to the uh, Billabong. Uh, watch out for crocodiles. Uh. You're just in time for a nice snag fresh off the barbie. Good day, lovely. How about a game of boomerang? <laughs> 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 I know you'd rather be there than here at the castle. And if Algy can't go to Australia... Then Australia must come to Algy. Oh, thank you. Algy, love, whatever's the matter? Uh, it, it's just that it's not Australia I miss. It's me bedroom. I'm not used to sleeping anywhere else. I think he might be homesick. Homesick? It means he's missing home, sweetheart. Oh. And his bedroom. I suppose I'd miss mine too if I had to stay somewhere else. Gather round, everyone. I'm going to remind you all of the rules of the mega race. Oh, I think I've pulled something. Is everyone here? I can't see the princess anywhere. Hmm, oh, that's strange. Where is she? Not sure. Don't know. Not here. Oh, I'll go and find her, shall I? Princess? Are you up there? I'm not a princess. I'm a sloth. Eh? Until the race, I'm a sloth. And sloths live in trees. A sloth? I thought you were a cheetah. Professor said I need to go slow and save my energy, like a sloth, so I can go extra fast in the mega race. Well, everyone's waiting for you. OK, I'm coming. No 
your princess? She's coming. Slowly. She's a sloth. A what? Uh, really? Never mind that. While we're waiting, let's remind ourselves of the mega race. Three races in one. First up, the egg and spoon race. Keep your egg on the spoon. If you drop it, you're out. Next, the balloon race. Keep it from touching the ground. If the balloon touches the floor, you're out. And finally, the beanbag race. Place it on your head. Ooh, very good. If the beanbag drops off your head, you're out. That's the spirit. Whoever crosses the finish line first wins the trophy. Ooh. Now, let's start the race. We can't. Princess isn't here yet. Oh. I believe this is all your fault, Professor. Cheetahs and sloths, whatever next. Why don't I, uh, go and see how the sloth is getting on? We could have a little sit-down while we wait. Oh, yes. <sighs> Take the weight off a bit. Oh, that's nice. Smash it. Mm -hmm. It's lovely and warm. <sighs> the sun's making me ever so sleepy. <gasps> I can't keep my eyes open. <sighs> Hello. I don't suppose the sloth might like to speed up a bit, please? The mega race is about to start. But the slower I am now, the faster I'll be in the race. You said so. Ah, uh, yes. Don't worry. I'll get there as fast as I can. For a sloth. <sighs> Here. Hello, Princess. Is it tomorrow? At last. Sorry. I've been saving my energy for the race. In that case, now we're all here. Starting positions, please. Here we go. I think my spoon is this going to be fun. Let's give it a go. Ready. On your marks. Get set. Go! And they're off to a flying start. <laughs> Oh. Everything all right, Princess? It's not easy going fast when you've got to balance thingies. I'm never going to win. Well, just be careful you don't drop anything. Oh. We have our first egg drop. Queen, you're out. <laughs> Sorry, Nessie. General, you're out. Two out and three runners to go. Oh, 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 oh. Phew. The general and queen were in too much of a hurry, I'm afraid. That's how things get dropped. Maybe slow and steady does win the race. And now, the balloon race. Oopsie daisy. King, you're out. <laughs> Careful, maid. Your balloon is about to touch the ground. <sighs> that was close. And princess has caught up with maid. I've never seen a mega race this close before. Come on, sweetheart. For the beanbag race. Whoa. <gasps> Slow and steady. Just like a sloth. Maid is making a break for the finish line. <gasps> oh, beanbags. Maid, you're out. You've got it. And only Princess is left now on the inside lane. Come on, Princess. You can do it, Poppet. And Princess is the winner! I did it! Bravo! Oh, no. so wonderful! Well done, Princess. Oh, first Hooray! Nice. Hooray! Photo for the wall. See? Slow and steady won the race. Uh, <laughs> it must be here somewhere. This is where Mummy keeps all her old things. Oh, yes! 
This looks like them. Precious, <laughs> what's that noise? Oh, good. The Queen's old bagpipes. Uh-huh. I'm making a charm bracelet. Just like Mummy's. So I have to learn to be good at the bagpipes. Oh? They look a bit different to my trumpet. What are these legs for? Hmm. Maybe I can remember. You put the bag under your arm. Mm, the legs are drones over your shoulder. And your fingers over these little holes. And blow. <laughs> oh, I think I need a bit more practice. <laughs> Can I have a go now, please? <laughs> Princess is learning to play the bagpipes, General. Ah, uh, 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 I didn't really think there was a monster in the castle. Hmm. <laughs> I don't think I'm very good at the bagpipes. It's a bit hard. What a lovely sunny day. I wonder where the princess is. <laughs> Do you like my makeup? I prefer a more natural look myself. Besides, you don't need makeup. You've got lovely young skin. Uh, Mr. Bit. Uh, there. Now, let's go and see what's for lunch. Ahem! Shoes, Princess. Oh. No. Not there. Not you. Ah, oh, there you all are. Here's my tree treasure. Acorn people. Goodness. They're very nice. Yes, they are. And tomorrow I'm going to play catching the leaves as they fall off my tree. That sounds like fun. Time for princesses to be in bed. Gardener is going to have a lot of work tidying up all these leaves tomorrow. It's going to be a windy night. <sighs> I like the wind. It means more leaves to play with. Mm, if you say so. Nighty nighty. Sleep tighter. Here's Flush. Okie dokie. <laughs> <laughs> a play with the lovely new loo, too, if I may. Yes, nearly finished. <sighs> Isn't it wonderful? So many special features. Lid opening. Hmm, it's special, all right. Will he be all right in there? Of course he will. Don't worry. Teddy's like a good wash every now and then. He's being really brave. He is. <sighs> is that splinter hurting, Princess? It is a bit ouchy. Then I think it's time we got it out. <gasps> but you can't do it now. I haven't got Gilbert to cuddle. But we don't want your hand getting any worse, Princess. Well... Okay. I suppose I'll just have to be brave, too. Ah, what a lovely sunny day. And when the sun is shining, everyone is... happy? I'm not. I'm sorry, Princess, but it hasn't rained in weeks. We can't waste water filling your paddling pool. I'm afraid you'll just have to wait until it rains again. Oh. Ah, there 
you are, Princess. Time to tidy your bedroom, eh? Uh... And help me clear the pond of weeds. Ooh. And get Nessie some fresh straw. Uh -uh. It sounds like you've got rather a lot to do, Princess. But I said I'd do it later. I've got to draw a picture first. The sooner you help everyone, the sooner you can draw your picture. Oh. Ah, can you help us look for Puss and Scruff, please, Puppet? No, I can't. Oh, why not, sweetheart? Because I'm very busy and everyone keeps asking me to do more things. Nessie only wants a bit of hay. But I... I have somewhere to go. <laughs> the call of the sea. Where are you headed, Princess? <sighs> to a place. What place? A place where I don't have to do things till later. Hmm, is that right? Where I don't have to tidy up or clean ponds or fetch hair or search for hiding pets. And uh, where, 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 where might this be? Um, the land of sugar and spice. Well, I never. Tropical straws. But this is her home. Well, I'm sure she'll stay. Anyone seen Princess? <laughs> Have you finished uh, counting the spoons? Six. There's definitely six spoons. Uh, very good. Uh, voila! Is there anything else I can lend a hand with? But of course. You can uh, count the potatoes, eh? <sighs> One. Two, three... How's it going, Princess? Lending a hand isn't much fun here either. Oh. I want to do something proper to help. Four... Uh, princess... Five... <laughs> Oh, my. What are to do? What are you doing on the floor, Chef? I was tripped by a potato. It was an accident. <laughs> Let's get him on here. Ah, there you go. Oh, yeah. Off to the sofa for you. Yes, we must look at that foot. I was just lending a hand. Of course you were. I rather think Chef is making a big trifle out of a tiny jelly. Hello, Chef. Are you all right? I am... Uh, oh, a little better, huh? I made you this to say sorry. Oh, thank you, Princess. But do not feel bad. Huh? It was the fault of this naughty potato. But... We do have a problem, no? Who will cook you delicious, tasty food? No delicious, tasty food? We're going to have to eat cold tin peas with no chef. No chef? No chef? What? Cold tin peas? <laughs> bon, so, my creation should be ready at... Uh... Chef? Oh, quel surprise! Oh, sorry. Do you know what they eat in Australia? Uh-huh. They have some delicious things there, even if they are not French. Huh? Hey, let me show you, huh? Oh. And you take your square of cake, dunk it in the chocolate, and then, into the flicky, flicky coconut, eh, voila! <laughs> you have a lambing huh? Eh? An Australian cake. Oh, can me and Algy make a lamington, please, Chef? Oh, uh, may we? Oops! Quite a revolting. Chef, come to the great hall, please. Mm. Oh. <laughs> so many dirty dishes, so 
so little dab. <laughs> Hello, Chef. Would you like me to wash those dishes for you? Huh? You want to wash up? Well, I never. <laughs> There's a lot to do, Princess. I know. But I'm earning stickers today to get a doll's house for... for Gilbert. Oh. Uh, very well. That would be most helpful, at least. Then I can clean my cupboards, huh? <laughs> oh, goody! I've always wanted a doll's house. I've got a tiny tea set somewhere that would go perfectly in one. Gilbert would love a tiny tea set. Oh, la, la! Ah, how did that get in here? <laughs> Ah. <laughs> ah, a nice, tidy cupboard. Eh? <laughs> ah, my hat is not for cleaning dishes. No, no, no. I think I would prefer to wash the dishes myself. Oh. oh! Sorry. I don't think we'll be getting a sticker here, Gilbert. Oh, I can't see anything shiny and gold here. I'll just have to move these things. Here you are, Chef. I brought a few parcels inside for you. Oh, uh, let me have them. <laughs> I think they might have been hiding some gold. Ah, merci bien, Princess. I hope you find your gold. Oh, yeah. Oh, lots of keys. <laughs> Chef, what are these keys for? Ah, they open almost everything in the castle. Huh? Oh, goody. <laughs> May I borrow them, please? Uh, because uh, Gilbert needs them to open something. There we princess. But bring them straight back, huh? Oh. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> ah, bonjour, princess. Can I help? That pasta looks good for sticking. Bendy, skinny, or fluttery? Huh? Fluttery? Bendy. <laughs> Ah, I was going to use that for supper. <sighs> what are you doing? Princess. What is going on, eh? Glue, glue, gluey, glue. <laughs> Good. Oh, I see. Oh. Are you sure you want to do that, Princess? Hey, she is on a roll. Yes, with my loo roll. And if I push it this way, he goes backwards. And if I push it this way... He goes forwards? Sideways. Oh! And look what else Gilbot can do. Watch out for coconuts. Where? <laughs> Hello! This robot is funny, huh? <laughs> He's my new favourite toy. Oh! Gilbert no longer, no? Gilbert? Uh, well... He's having a rest at the moment. You look a bit fed up, Princess. I am. I wanted to take pictures of interesting animals doing interesting things. Like on Vasari. Yes? But there aren't any interesting animals doing interesting things. And now it's raining. It sounds as if something interesting might be happening indoors, though. Oh! Allez, allez! Allez, Oost! Oh! That is quite interesting. I wonder what 
what else I can find. Voila. That looks difficult. I can show you a better way to do it. <sighs> Decorating the little cakes is a delicate process, huh? Oh, sorry. <laughs> It's seesaw de uh -uh. The picnic is off, Princess. What? But it's our seesaw picnic. I'm afraid I have to clean this mess instead. Thanks to Maid. I was just tying your hair in little bunches so you could see better. It made me forget to put the lid on the blender. And now, we have a pink catastrophe, huh? <laughs> <laughs> At least Gardner will still help. Aha! Uh -huh. Today we have a sprout surprise. Enjoy! Mwah. We know it's not your favorite, sweetheart, but it's very good for you. Eat up. Oh. Okay. I'll be really brave. Gilbert really likes it, so he's going to eat it too. Now I've been brave and eaten the yucky sprout surprise, can I have a medal? Sorry, Poppet, but you haven't really eaten it. Oh. Do you have a machine like a... Like a what, Princess? Like a chef. Well... I may just have something. As Chef would say, voila! Oh, what is it? My auto handy. It does everything a pair of hands can do. Observe. <laughs> With a little tinkering, I'm sure this could be a chef. <gasps> Can I lend a hand? Doing something proper? I thought you'd never ask. Could you polish my spanner for me, please? <sighs> okay. Ta-da! Well, what would you like to eat? I rather fancy a cheese and pickle sandwich. Ooh, um, an egg salad for me, please. <laughs> Fit for a queen. And we mustn't forget the chef. <laughs> Just what the doctor ordered. <laughs> a flapjack and a glass of milk for chef. I brought you something to eat. Ah, oh, thank you, princess. Oh, it will help with the swelling, huh? Oh, mm. oh magnifique. Uh, where did you get it? Professor's new invention made it in the kitchen. Oh, I see. I see. What? In my kitchen? Mm. Mm. Better than mm. It's my oh. favorite. What oh. is this? Ah, Chef, come and join us. Mm -hmm. oh, mm -hmm. Marvellous. <laughs> it's even wearing my hat. Oh, I no longer have a job. I am an ex-chef. <laughs> Would you like a little nibble? No, I would not. <laughs> 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 Let's get out of here. Retreat. How do we stop it, Professor? A lever at the back. Mm -hmm. I'm to the 
defend my kitchen! On guard! Princess, huh? Thanks. Well, well done, done, Princess. Well done. Good job you were here to lend a hand. Marvellous, marvellous. Yeah. Well, at least I finally got to do something proper. Oh, you hmm. did. Certainly did, yeah. <laughs> like a brave chef, I shall return to my kitchen. Jolly good. And maybe your chef matic should return to your workshop, Professor. Yes, good idea. But first, <laughs> you'd better clean up this kitchen, eh, Professor? Are you still, um, lending a hand today, Princess? Ah. Uh... <laughs> if Puss and Scruff are lending a hand, then I can too. Splendid. <clears throat> and so can you! Well, mm. Yes, I'm sure we can help. Yes. Come on, General. Hop to it. right oh, huh? What are you doing, Princess? Huh? Looking. The egg hatched. Just like I said. Oh! And what came out? It sounds like a penguin, but it wriggles like an alligator. And now it's run away! <gasps> Unusual, no? Would you like me to help you find it? Yes, please. First, we must look for clues. Look! A feather. <gasps> and webby footprints. <gasps> it's a feathery alligator with webby penguin feet. Oniva, let's follow them. <laughs> Ah, bonjour. Hello, General. Have you both come to watch us jump? No. We're looking for a feathery animal with webby feet that makes cheap, cheap noises. It hatched out of the egg. Ooh, that sounds like a flamingo to me. Oh. Ah, no, no. All the flamingos I have seen have pink feathers. Aha, uh -huh. but baby flamingos have grey ones. Nessie and I could help you find it too if you like. Thank you, General. Well, what now, Princess? It's nearly tea time. Maybe we should put out some food so it comes to us. Yes, but Princess, what does it eat, huh? Uh, baked beans? <laughs> like me? Uh, hmm. Tea time! Lots of yummy baked beans! Where has the chef got to? I'm starving after all that wallpapering. Um, what are you doing, Poppin? Putting baked beans on the grass. The egg hatched. Oh, and... What came out? Something no one's seen before. It wriggles like an alligator and has webbed feet. It makes chippy chippy noises like a penguin. And it's got feathers like a flamingo. It's a... a flam penguinator. A flam penguinator? Sweetheart, you told us twice that the egg had hatched. And it hadn't. Are you quite sure you're telling the truth now? Well, I think it's a flam penguinator. I haven't actually seen it yet. What? Sacre bleu. Princess, it's very important not to make things up. Cos when you do tell the truth, no one will believe you. Oh. Is that why no one came when I called before? Oh, sorry. All right, Poppet. We know you're only excited. But now it really has 
hatched. And I found this. Indeed. I saw the broken shell. And webbed footprints. And heard chippy chipping. In that case, let's all be quiet and search for it. Whatever it is, it won't want these baked beans. Bonjour, princess. I'm looking for somewhere to be quiet. Is it your day off too? It is. And on my day off, I like to create new, fabulous recipes huh? like this. Oh, can I watch you make it? <laughs> of course. But I need you to be absolutely quiet so I can concentrate. Hmm? What kind of cake is it? Ah, a big one. Shh. Can I taste it once it's finished? Mm -hmm. shh, 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 shh. That's a lot of sugar! Sorry. I was trying to be quiet. Mm -hmm. The cake! Oh, 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 my cake! Oh, no, no, no. Blow. It is ruined. It might be okay underneath. Huh? Oh, wait. It is! Oh, thank you, Princess. A few moments more, and it would have been completely burnt. Is everyone okay? I heard yelling. Princess saved my cake. Jolly good. I best get back to finding my pesky stamp. I just don't know where it's gone. It's behind you. Oh, no, it isn't. Oh, yes, it is. <laughs> oh, no, it isn't. Oh, oh yes, yes, it is. is. Where? On, On your, your bottom! bottom. <laughs> Why didn't you tell me sooner? I was trying to be quiet. Well, being loud has certainly helped me today, Princess. Huh? Me too. <laughs> Hello again, Princess. It looks as though you've got the hang of being quiet. At last. Is it easy after all? Shh! I'm playing a game. I got to choose it. First, I have to be quiet. And then... You're it! <laughs> Cake, everyone! Yummy! Ooh. Oh, Lovely jubbly! Thanks to Princess who saved it! <laughs> Doesn't it look delicious? Biggest piece for me, please! Mmm! Mm. Yummy! And just a little bit for you three, huh? <laughs> oh. <gasps> <laughs> this is when I'm best at being quiet! Hop, step! Shuffle it, other bit, change. Oh, princess, your tippy tappy dance is très bien. Go, hop, shuffle. Oh. <sighs> but it must be hard for you to concentrate with my radio and mixer, no? You're right, it is. How about the great hall? Your tappy tappy would sound magnifique in there. <sighs> okay, I'll try it. Thank you! Phew! Voila! I'm here to collect the puddings, please, Chef. Of course, eh? And where are you taking these delicious treats, Princess? Hmm? To two surprise teas for two. Huh? Oh, it's all too, too much, eh? Too, <laughs> too much. Princess. Morning, Chef. 
I need some beans, please. Oh, some baked beans, perhaps, huh? Mm, I think so. Uh, do you want them on toast? No, thank you. Oh. And where are you off to now? To help get her not birthday tea ready. And voila! Mmm. I think that one's a bit wonky. What? No, no, no! Oh, my creation! Oops! Oh. I was only trying to help. <laughs> Tastes yummy, though. Uh, perhaps the king and queen would like your help instead, huh? Oh, is it a hot water bottle? No, this is much better. It's a whoopee cushion. A whoopsie what? I'll show you. <gasps> Come on. <laughs> ah, shit. Voila! <laughs> oh, well done, Chef. I expect you need a nice sit down now. Hmm? Oh, no, no, no. I am. I am busy, huh? Go on. Just for a minute. I'll even put this tea towel down to make it extra comfy. Oh. Go on, Chef. Have a lovely. <laughs> <laughs> what is this, huh? Very funny, huh? <laughs> Isn't it just? Oh, well, Princess, we didn't get Chef, but we certainly got Puss. We did! I love it! Who can we get next? Maybe someone else who didn't want me to help them today. <clears throat> oh, yeah. Hello, Alja. Oh, hello, Princess. What would you both like for breakfast, huh? Uh, mm. Boiled egg, please. Oh, me too. Copycat. <laughs> That's a very good painting. Thank you. When I paint flowers, I always paint a sun in the sky. Oh, I like that. I will too. <laughs> Copycat. <laughs> and voila. Thank you. Thank you. I also know the yummiest way to eat a boiled egg. <laughs> Yummy. Told ya. I must now prepare for the competition. Oh, what are you making, Chef? A castle cake, of course. <laughs> Here is my plan. It is going to have three layers of sponge with ice cream cone tights and lots of chocolate icing, huh? <laughs> Chef, where is the apple juice, please? I can't see any. Oh? Oh, uh, perhaps uh, try the ladder, huh? Rice, tins, biscuits, carrots. Oh, there isn't any in there either. No apple juice? No, and we always have it on a hot day. Mm. Aha! Why don't we make some? Make some? How? <laughs> With apples, of course. Voila. <laughs> I just need to get a little something. Oh. Hello again, Princess. Are you okay? Uh huh. I'm thinking. I see. And what are you thinking about? About how to make this into a lovely drink. And what are you going to do with that? I'm going to see if I can suck the juice out. Oh, too floppy. Hmm, maybe I can squish the juice out. Um, what are you doing now, Princess?
apron. Uh, that doesn't look very comfy. It's not. Oh, and it isn't working. I need something bigger. Uh, Chef, I think you should sit down. You look very tired. Oh, thank you, Princess. A sit down would be nice and... Ow! What is an apple doing on there? Sorry, I was trying to squish the juice out with your bottom. Uh, my bottom is not for squishing apples, but... This is. Ooh, how does it work? <laughs> Please fetch the jug. And hold it under here. And. <laughs> voila! Ooh, it's working! Oh, that's not enough for everyone to have a drink. No. I think we need more apples. Have you got any more apple juice yet, Poppet? Uh, nearly! Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh la la! Here we have as many apples as we need. <gasps> oh, where have all the apples gone? Someone has beaten us to it. <laughs> Horace! Shoo shoo! Big greedy horse here! to reach them. Mm. Oh, my princess, have you grown? You're as tall as the tree. <laughs> no, silly. Oh, this is a thirsty work, no? Uh-huh. But soon we'll be able to have a nice glass of apple juice. <laughs> Is it enough to make a drink for everyone? Oui, oui, I believe so. Good day. Uh, princess, uh, may I have a little help here, please? Okay. to take a long time to squish all these with that little thing. Hmm. We need something bigger. Uh, an apple squisher that is bigger than this, huh? <laughs> and bigger than your bottom. Aha! <laughs> uh -huh. That's right, this is. Almost there, this is. <sighs> Ready, everyone? Good. On the squisher, please. 
jump like that in ages. We did it! Hooray! Hooray! And now we can all have apple juice! Well done, Princess and Chef. What a clever way to make our own. Shall we all go and cool down now with a lovely cold drink? Yay! Oh, good idea. Follow me. I have just the thing to go with it. How's it going so far, Princess? Being super speedy like a cheetah? Um, good. <laughs> See? Uh, slow down, Princess. <laughs> Sorry, Professor. That's uh, all right, Princess. Didn't you see me there? No, I was running too fast. Well, perhaps you ought to slow down a bit. Everyone keeps saying that. Is that right? Mm, I suppose going fast did make me trip over maid and make a mess at breakfast and bump into you. Oh, dear. But I'm a cheater, just like you told me to be. I have to go fast. But cheaters aren't fast all the time, Princess, only when they need to be. Slow and steady wins the race after all. Slow and steady? It means not rushing, so you don't fall over or lose concentration. And you save your energy for going fast when you need to. Oh, like in the mega race today? What animal goes slow and steady? Mmm, the slowest creature I've ever met is a sloth. A sloth? Follow me. This furry little rascal is a sloth. I met him on a trekking adventure. Sloths move really slowly. So they never fall over and aren't messy eaters. Exactly. And more importantly... They save their energy so they're fast at races. Well, they don't bump into professors anyway. I want to be a sloth. Hello down there. Hello, Professor. What's that? My new flying machine. I'm going to travel the sky and fish for rain clouds. I hear we might need some. Oh, oh, what a good idea. Rain clouds are just what we need. Could you bring back some big ones, please? Coming. Ready, Ready or not. not. Ooh, I need somewhere to hide. Why don't you climb aboard, then? My basket is the perfect place. Good. <laughs> Thank you. In the go. Look out, Sky! Here we come! Remember to bring back a rain cloud or two! <laughs> ah, uh, you haven't seen Princess, have you, Gardner? She seems to have vanished into thin air. Oh, has she really? Can you see Princess anywhere, Professor? Princess? Little girl in a white dress? <laughs> Where's a crown? Ah, uh, I can't see her down there anywhere. Everything looks so small. Things will look a lot bigger through this. Ooh, thank you, Professor. Where did our ping pong ball go? Hmm, I'm not sure. It was here a minute ago. Princess? Up here! Oh, -ho! there you are, Puppet. What are you uh, up to? Hiding! Cloud fishing. Oh, are you? Well, could you look out for our ping-pong ball while you're at it? Ah, where is my wooden spoon? One moment it was here, and the next... Huh. Hello, Chef! Princess? I can hear you, but uh, I cannot see you. Oh, yeah! <gasps> oh, la, la! Hello, Princess. Uh, what are you doing up there? We're cloud fishing. Oh, can you look out for my wooden spoon? It is missing. OK. Toodaloo. Scroll. <laughs> Cheeky Scruff is always up to something. Look, Princess, straight ahead. 
clouds. I'm sure of it. Oh, yes. Little fluffy white ones. Fancy joining me in a little cloud fishing while you're hiding? Always carry a spare, just in case. Yes, please. I've never fished for clouds before. Neither have I. Let's get going. Any luck, Princess? No. I think this net's too... swishy. Hmm. Too swishy, indeed. Aha! Uh -huh. uh -huh. Let's try these instead. Oh! We'll get a bumper catch this time. I just know it. Ready? Steady. Go! Oh. Nothing. Not even a tiddler. Come on, clouds. Don't be shy now. I'll see if there are any other clouds. Ones that are more catchy. I need to keep my fleet afloat. <laughs> Sorry, Admiral, but my lettuces need a drink. Onward, me hearties! Another one that got away. Professor, why don't we be the wind? Y uh, mm? We could blow the clouds like Admiral blows the sails on his boats. I think you might be onto something, Princess. Those look quite blowy. Oh, they keep fluffing away. I don't think this is going to work either, Princess. No. No rain clouds for us today. Oh, I say. Everything's gone all grey. Hmm. We seem to be in some kind of giant misty pocket. Let's go into land, shall we? Hang on. <laughs> Cloud fishing, and what a whopper we caught. Good trip, Puppet. Very good. <laughs> and I've got something to show you. <gasps> My paddling pool is full! The rain filled it right up. My wooden spoon! Has anyone seen my wooden spoon? Our ping pong ball is missing too. And my troll. What were you doing by that bush? Hello, hello there, Princess. That naughty, tinny thing it ruined my tower, Professor. My sincere sorriness. That naughty, tinny thingy is a robot. I've just built it. A robot? What does one of those do? Ooh, let me show you. It's my best toy yet. Oh! Fetch me a spanner, please. No! Can it really? Your robot is a very clever toy, Professor. Do you think you could make me a robot toy, Professor? I'd be delighted, Princess. <laughs> Go on, Princess. Whip off the cover. <laughs> oh. He's so shiny! <laughs> I'll show you how he works. First, you take hold I of... I know already. Thank you. Oh. <laughs> I feel purple. 
You're a sprout. <laughs> Who are you calling a sprout? Professor! I've brought Gilbot back. You have? He doesn't look after me very well at night. Hmm, I see. And he's a bit breaky. <laughs> What's a <laughs> daisy going to break? <laughs> 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 Are you all right, Princess? I want to lend a hand and make things better, but I don't know how to cook. I see. Is there something else you could do instead? Maybe I could ask for help. <laughs> Hello, Professor. Are you OK? I'm more than OK. I'm positively splendid. I wish I was splendid. Why the long face, Princess? Well, I tried to lend a hand counting spoons, but a potato escaped and hurt Chef's ankle, and now we're going to have to eat cold tin peas. Ah. Can you help? I should think so. <laughs> What does this do? I'm not quite sure yet, but it did just go bang, so best not to touch, eh? Besides, my workshop is full of other wonderful creations to marvel. Like my disco fish tank. The fish go tank. Do you have a machine like a... Like a what, Princess? Like a chef. Well... I may just have something. As Chef would say, voila! Oh, what is it? My auto handy. It does everything a pair of hands can do. Observe. <laughs> With a little tinkering, I'm sure this could be a chef. <gasps> And can I lend a hand doing something proper? I thought you'd never ask. Could you polish my spanner for me, please? <sighs> OK. Ta-da! Well, what would you like to eat? I rather fancy a cheese and pickle sandwich. Ooh, um, an egg salad for me, please. Fit for a queen. <laughs> Hello. Uh, something funny down there on the floor? They're playing my game. Splendid. Do you want to play? Well, I've actually come to show everyone my latest invention. Invention? invention? <laughs> Ta da! Allow me to demonstrate my voice activated device. She's called Pandora. Pandora, where are we? You are in the royal castle. Oh, oh, me. Pandora is very clever. And watch this. Pandora, close the curtains. <laughs> Pandora, open the curtains. Never seen anything like it. Pandora can also control the washing machine and the vacuum cleaner. Really? Ask her. Pandora, would you vacuum the carpet, please? <laughs> Pandora can even play music. Music? Oh, Pandora, play as a tune. <laughs> <laughs> Wonderful! She is, isn't she? Quite my best invention. Can I play with Pandora now? Would you like to play? Sorry, Princess. Without Pandora, 
I have to play my mouth organ so the king and queen have music to dance to. Oh, and the prime minister doesn't know the music like Pandora. It's going to take us twice as long to practice. What's wrong, princess? Now I've hidden Pandora, no one has time to play with me. Oh, dear. Perhaps you ought to bring Pandora back. But she seemed a little bit broken. Oh, but maybe if I bring her back, we can fix her. Then she can help everyone and there might still be time for a game before bedtime. What a good idea, Princess. I say, where's Pandora? Bad news, Professor. Pandora is, uh, missing. Ah! No, she isn't! I've got her! Where has she been, Poppet? I... I, I hid her. Why, sweetheart? Because I thought I broke her. I accidentally flicked my pudding at her. I see. Oh, dear. I was cross because I thought you liked Pandora more than me. But, Puppet, we only wanted Pandora to help us. I know. I'm sorry. You should have been more careful, Puppet. Pandora is for everyone to use. But you've told the truth now. Yeah, yeah. And you've said you're sorry. Not to worry, Princess. I'm going to mend her. Oh. <laughs> Screwdriver. <laughs> Suction. <laughs> Big important looking control box thing. <laughs> ah, ah, I found the problem. A little bit of <laughs> banana and custard. Exactly. Let's test her out, shall we? Pandora, where are we? You are in the royal castle. Correct! Yay! Yay! <laughs> Ready now. Princess, is everyone here? Ready! Here we go, then. Da -da 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 -da. Oh. Ladies and gentlemen, may I present to you my latest invention. A machine that does all your morning chores for you. Oh. Hmm. To help me demonstrate, may I introduce my lovely assistant. <laughs> Hop on then, General. That's the stuff. Need to wash your face? My machine will do it for you. Oh, look at that! Need to brush your hair? <laughs> Ooh, that tickles! My machine will do that too. Uh, excellent! <laughs> never... And once you're all washed and brushed and ready for the day... Marvellous in bed. Well done! What an excellent idea. Come on then, Princess. Let's go to my shed. <laughs> so, what would you like to invent, Princess? Hmm. I don't know. How do you decide what you're going to invent? Well... What I do is I put on my thinking cap, then I sit down and try to think of things that might make life easier and more fun for everyone. Oh, does your thinking cap make you clever? Sometimes. You can borrow it if you like. Oh, thank you. I still can't decide. What do you think everyone would like me to invent, Professor? Well, why don't you ask them? Chef, what would you like me to invent? Oh, um, saucepans that wash themselves, huh? <laughs> uh, 
flying armchair to take me around the world and then back in time for tea. An automatic pen to sign things so I can ride my trike instead. Mm. Nice hat, Princess. And it's already given me an idea for an invention. Will you help me? Of course. What are we waiting for? <gasps> I think Scruff is hot too. Would he like some water? <laughs> Thank you, Professor. What's next, Princess? Are we finished? Yes. But it's not working. I think I need to have another think. Oh, no! My owl hat's gone! Uh, I can't think without it! Oh, dear. You must have left it downstairs. Don't worry. I'll get it for you. Oh, dear. Oh, dear, oh, dear. Ah, General! The princess has lost a very special hat. Have you seen it? What's it like? It's like an owl. Oh. Uh, it's about so big, brown and furry, and it's very important to the princess. Well, if it's very important, she could borrow my hat, I suppose. Hmm. Yes. That might just do it. Thank you, General. Toodaloo. Did you find it? Well, I've got something which I suspect may work just as well. <coughs> oh, no! Phew! Now I can think again. <coughs> That's not my owl hat. No, it belongs to the general and it worked just as well. You mean I fixed my invention without my owl hat? You did. Now, are you ready? something wonderful. And I'll never have to run all over the castle to get everyone again. But look what my invention can do to your veggies. <laughs> I call it my water whopper machine. But it's not natural. I like my veggies normal sized. Who wants normal sized when you can have whopper sized? This huge cabbage has upset my new arrival, Griselda. Griselda? Well, I can't see her anywhere. Exactly. <laughs> Maybe just needs a few adjustments. <laughs> Morning, gardener. Can I plant my beans and grow a beanstalk, please? Ah, at last. Someone who wants to grow something naturally. Huh? <laughs> you can plant your beans over there, princess. <laughs> hey, hey, hey. Oh, no, you don't. Oh, a sunflower bean stalk. Can I grow it now? <laughs> Oi, you keep away from my rhubarb. Let's get you planted. <laughs> Oh, what?
What's wrong, princess? It's still tiny. Yes, but in a couple of months, it will be much bigger. And... Months? But I want to climb it today. <laughs> but, princess, even sunflowers don't grow that quickly. Oh, a couple of months is forever. I suppose it is a long time for a princess to wait. But uh, <laughs> that professor again! <laughs> Lovely. <gasps> professor! Good morning, princess. Can your machine make things big? Big like giant sunflower beanstalk big? Beanstalk big? Well, I've never turned it to full power before. Let's find out. Oh, goody. Follow me. Please make my sunflower beanstalk grow giant. Uh, no, you don't. But I want a giant sunflower beanstalk. <laughs> Princess, this is my garden and I have... Please! <sighs> Oh, well, just this once. Thank you. And only the sunflower. Righty-ho, princess. Stand well back. Full power coming up. It, it'll work in a minute. Ah! Whoa! It worked. What a whopper. Wow. You mongers. I've never seen such a thing. And all my own work. I bet there's a goosey up there that lays golden eggs. <laughs> I'm going to climb it now. Hold on tight, Poppy. Come on, everyone. We can use this to catch her when she comes back down. Goosey, are you up there? Nearly there, Princess. Keep going. <laughs> 